Yo, what's going on guys? It is the Big K dropping in for a new video for you guys. So I really wanted to make a video on the best way to farm materials in Fortnite Battle Royale. Now, farming materials is probably easily one of the most boring parts about playing Fortnite. In my own opinion, you know, I just hate farming materials. It gets boring, especially if you farm materials and you die. So I'm gonna show you guys the best way to farm some mats. So the best way, in my opinion, to farm mats is to incorporate it in your looting. See, there was a guy in here, I just, I just smacked him, and, uh, you know, he was looting. He was looting, he was looking for guns, he was looking for ammo, shields, health, whatever it may be. But he wasn't farming material while he was doing that, and I think that's just a bad idea, man. Because you got all this material in here, man. You got the bed, it's all one shot, one shot, one shot, seven wood from that one. Eight wood, four wood, you got six wood there. Two shots on this, six metal. Destroy that, six wood, look at that. Look at all those mats we got from one room right here. All super easy and we just had a one shot everything. Just one shot, one shot, one trigger press, super easy, you get all these mats here. And these metal things, you gotta two shot them, the chairs, you two shot them. The desk, one shot. I mean, it's just like all the mats right here, dude. I mean, in this one building, you have a nice amount of materials that you could gain. Because I see lots of people, man. They, they loot, they're looting stuff. They're looking for guns and ammo and all that stuff. But they're just not looting, you know? They're, not, they're just not gathering the material that is in this house. And like beating on walls and shit, like look at this, like, I mean you really don't get many materials for beating on walls. But I mean once you start destroying this stuff, like the easy stuff, that's like one hit, super easy. You know, you get a lot of material. And we got that, 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 that. This thing here. This dining table over here, man this is mat heaven right here. Super easy. Bam. Got this kitchen right here. You got these chairs right here. You got this fireplace. TV. Right there. Bam. Look at that, dude. One house. That's all we did, dude. One house. And while we were looting and looking for ammo, weapons, and all that good stuff, we ended up getting like almost 400 mats all together. And I mean, that's it, dude. Dude, you're good right now. Like, I mean, it all depends on your play style. For me, I try to get at least 300 mats, and then I'm like, okay, I'm done with the farming because it just gets boring. You know, because I don't want to die and then have to farm mats again and stuff. But this is the best way to do it, in my opinion, man. But yeah, I always try to just hit the stuff that's like, you know, one shot, you know, that I could get materials from, like, boom, done, you know, just so I'm not beating on a tree for like 10 seconds and then I get shot in the back, you know, it's just like, bam, you're done and you get a little bit of mats, you know, but yeah, depending on your play style, I mean, it depends how much, you know, materials you want to gather. Like for me, 300 mats, I'm done at that point, you know, I'm, I'm good to build some stuff up, you know. But yeah, guys, definitely try it out, dude. Try to incorporate mat farming while you're looting. That's the best way to do it, in my opinion. You know, all the houses and stuff, all the um, furniture and chairs and desks and all that stuff, dude. It's so great for farming material. I mean, I use all my material just messing around. So, uh, but yeah, check it out, guys. Try, try that out, man. It's super easy. And, uh... It, it takes no time and it makes uh, mat farming a lot smoother, less boring and stuff. So I would definitely try it out, guys. That's it for the video, man. Peace out, y'all.